completely screw that one up. Right, all packed up, yep. Better lead to head off. Back south, gonna drop my sister off at Edinburgh, then going to Glasgow, and then, uh, yeah, stay there for the night. Head back home tomorrow. Using the last bits of the uh, lobby hotel Wi Fi. Heading off to Edinburgh, dropping off the sister, and then uh, onwards. So beautiful, so so quiet and peaceful and calm and still. The lake of the loch is just literally, it's like a mirror reflecting. Amazing, we have a photograph and then uh, I'm gonna keep going. some lunch and driving for like three hours quite tired see what this place is like we're so 100 miles away from Edinburgh but we've just seen a little distillery so little it's massive actually it's a really big distillery so we go there have a look at their whiskey um, collection, see what they're like. Might go in. It's quite expensive though, I think. Well, and I've, uh, we need to get back to get back to the city. So, have a look, eh? Have a look. Emily's tired as well. Both pretty really tired, as you can tell. What is it? Wonderful, thank you very much. Have a good day. We can get out this way. Okay. Got a bottle of whiskey. Um, I'm gonna get some photographs of this uh, distillery now. Just, uh, just a couple. Yeah, it's nice. It smells amazing in there. Right, I'll get some photographs and then we're gonna head off because we haven't got time. Stopped at M&S to pick up a uh, quick surprise birthday card for someone. I'm gonna visit. Here in Glasgow. I mean, if she watches my vlogs, then she'll know. But right now, she has no idea I'm getting there. Right. To... My handwriting is terrible, so I'll figure this out. <laughs> should really get my sister to do it. It's done. Right. We are a little bit behind, so better get going. I'm so tired. I just want to get into the bed and go to sleep.
Get him. Get we'll him do. Safe. Yeah. Get to Glasgow safe. We'll do. Let me know. Call me. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. I will. That was fun. Um, Go ahead back to the car. Left the uh, computer with the phone hot spotting. Trying to get yesterday's vlog uploaded at a service station. That was nice. It's always a pleasure talking to her. Right, I think I decided I'm gonna find a hotel. I'm gonna head down to uh, Lancashire area, about two hours away. Find a hotel, go into the lakes tomorrow morning, get some photographs of there, and then head back to Leicestershire. I think that's the plan. Sit rep. After leaving Glasgow about three hours ago, I'm sat in T-Bay Services looking for hotel rooms because I've kind of messed it up. I half expected to get to the Penrith and think that the internet was correct and the hotel that I looked at had a room. But when I got there, there wasn't, and I'd already bypassed Carlisle where there was loads of Premier Inns, but I figured, that's I don't want to stay in one of those. Even though they're great, I just, well, not great, but they're fine. I, you know, there's places better in Penrith. Um, but they didn't have any space. And then called the people at Kendall about half an hour ago. Nothing there. Uh, it is now five minutes to 12 and pretty much every reception is closed. Um, so yeah, so. I don't know, I should have brought a sleeping bag in a tent. Well, my friend said it was a stupid idea and I thought it was the best idea ever. But oh, well, never mind. Um, um, I guess you just have to wait until tomorrow to see whether I stay in the lakes or, you know, go back down south to Leicestershire. I'm sorry if this was boring. You know, travel days are pretty boring. You know, general travel days are, you know, kind of point A to point B and there's very little in between, you know, sometimes you may get lucky and you see something there, but that's you know, rare on most occasions. I guess you'll have to tune in tomorrow, see if I'm still in the lake or not. Um, wish me luck. Thanks for watching. Good night.